Hey there. Hi, Pixel. What you doing? Um, I only just now finally got the hand strap thingy tightened enough because, you know, my hands are little. Because I'm a kid. Anyway, my grandpa brought home from Magnolia, Arkansas, this Power Macintosh 6500-275. Um... The guy he got it from said he knew he knew it worked, and it had OS 9 on it, but somewhere along the lines, probably very recently, maybe when he was bringing it home, the hard drive failed. So, let's just get started. Hang on, I forgot to put the lens cap in the thingy that it's supposed to go in. Also, my dad bought me Sony Vegas, basically for back to school present. Let's get this thing on. So, I can't pull it out any farther? That's weird. Huh. Yeah. So, here it is. This is the keyboard. Listen carefully. That clicking is the hard drive attempting to spin up. But it's not happening. Sorry about all the shakiness. I'm shaking for some reason. Then it always sounds like it finally does spin up and then the monitor comes on. Cursor shows up. And then it knows somehow that the OS is on there. Except, it's doing less than it was earlier. Like, right now, before, it would show the Happy Mac forever, and then it would show the flashing disk. But listen. I don't know if you can hear it, it's a pretty quiet hard drive. Um, it sounds like it's still trying to boot the OS. So, I don't know. So, hang on. It has a built in zip drive, floppy disk drive, and. CD drive. I'm going to reinstall the OS. Yes, this is a home burned disk because I downloaded it off of winworldpc.com. Not sure what the system came with, but I can check if I can find my iPod Touch anywhere. No, I'm just giving it a minute. Well, hi. Uh, Big so get off. Keyboard. Okay. So now I can hear it booting from the CD. Yes, it comes with an Ethernet card, built-in modem. It comes with, it has all kinds of stuff in it. And it's a pretty powerful, good machine. If I can get it to work, I may. I would like to see if it would get on the internet, and if it would, this wouldn't be a bad computer for my mop, for my mops, for my aunt's school. I call her mop. That's why I actually said that. Okay. This disk is unreadable about this computer. Okay. Okay. Visualizing and erase all information on this disk.
pig, so stop eating feathers. There's the click of doom again. What? I don't think Pixel likes that noise. Pixel, don't mess with my floppy disks. Don't copy that floppy. Pixel. Pixel, please don't jump up there. No. Get down. Pixel, get down from there. You're blocking the vents. Ugh. Okay, it started making weirder noises now. Ugh. What you looking at, Pixel? This is getting weirder by the minute. Ugh. I wonder if it has anything to do with being right next to the monitor. Like maybe the monitor is emitting magnetic rays. I don't know. Hang on. The monitor looks like it needs to be degaussed. Okay, I'll tell you what. Ugh. Okay, um, it's been doing this for like three minutes now. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna stop recording and come back later and honestly, I don't think it has done anything different for the past 15 minutes. What? Okay, sorry, that sounded like the sound of a disc getting mounted on OS 9. Still going crazy. Got it. broken because I have no way of reinstalling the OS if the hard drive's busted oh duh that was silly of me this power button seems a little wicky wonky. What? 
Pixel? Pixel what? Um, all right, I'm not seeing any changes, are you? Just give me a minute, I need both hands. Okay, for whatever reason, this computer isn't working. I think I made it worse for trying to initialize the disk. That was a bad idea, because now, as you may have noticed, it won't boot from the CD anymore. So I've rendered this system unusable. <laughs> so... Unless I can get this gigantic thing to Oklahoma City and get this non-official Apple Store to fix it. And yes, there is a non-official Apple Store that will fix Vintage Max. I can do it. I, I mean, I think it was in Oklahoma City. I can't remember. Whatever my grandpa said. Why, the, why does the color depth seem so weird for some reason? Oh, whatever. Well, that's pretty much it. Bye.